Welcome to Combat Wing Chen. Today we're going to show you a few more Wing Chen dummy techniques, but we're going to do it a little bit differently. We have our awesome action cam today, and you're going to see it in first person mode. So stay tuned, and we can get into it right now. Today we're going to show you some of the techniques in the middle of the Wing Chun form from uh, Yip Man's uh, 116 moves. So this is the one where we start like this, and then we're going to go to the right, back to the left, go to the right, back to the left, and then when you get to the left, you're going to circle this one, and then you have the left arm come out down here, if you can see it. Okay. So that's all we're going to do. And then if you do it with the left hand, we start with the left hand and go in the front, then out, in, out, in, circle this way, on to the uh, mid section here. Okay, so a little bit faster will be, when we start with the right, will be one, two, three, and that. And then the like start with the left will be one, two, three, and that. So let's show you how to use that in the self defense application. Right, so if you're using this against an attack, this is what it's used for. So let's say your punch is coming, doesn't matter where. So you can use this to block this way. Another one is coming, you can use it to block this way. So basically, if his hands here, if your hands on this side, you're gonna push it out this way. If his hands on this side, you're gonna use it this way. Just like you did on the dummy, right? You go to the right, to the left, to the right. Same thing. So. It doesn't matter which hand it is, if it's on the left, we're going to go out to the left. If it's on the left still, you can go out to the left again. If it's on the right side, you're going to use that to redirect to the left, and so on. Okay, so basically you can just use this hand in the front to do all the redirecting that you need. So he's going to do any kind of attack, he'll do this way, this way, do another one, this way, this way, this way, this way, this way. This way, okay. So remember, to see why I did in the last one there, okay. So I got this one, he does that one, he does another one. If I go on this side, but I want to move it to the other side, so I do the hood, and now he's on this side, okay. So let's say I'm fighting with my uh, right hand in front here. So basically, this action is going to redirect anything on this side, and then if there's something coming on this side, this action is this action will redirect everything on this side. So it doesn't matter if he's punching me with his left hand, go this way, and this way with this hand, or he's punching me with that hand, go this way, he's on this way, he's gonna go on this hand, okay? So he can punch any punch he wants, go this way, this way, this way, this way, this way, and so on. Okay, go this way, I keep going this way, I can hit this way, and this way, and then this way, okay? So basically, you should be able to redirect stuff uh, all with the front hand in this motion. Okay, so if you use the softer way, it'll look something like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And notice that whenever I'm doing it, I am not moving it too far out to the left and right. Because in the dummy, you can see there's only this much space in between them. So I'm moving from here, little tiny movements, right? Because if you move too far to the right, then you open yourself up too much. Okay? So when I'm doing the redirection, I'm just doing a little bit out, open up middle for an attack okay so if he's going to come this way and then opening up just a little bit enough on this side and you're going to tap here just open it up just to make it pass me pass me right it's missing me just so that i can open it enough so that i can attack on the inside so just to summarize we're going to use this motion and you can use it basically as your first line of defense any punch comes in any kind of attack, this is your first line of defense because it's the closest to whatever is coming in. So you can use it to, first of all, immediately overtake the center line with that one motion. But instead of just staying there like in the Wing Chun dummy form, which is just doing this, I'm going to combine it with a step. So it goes, boom. And then now, now look what happened. I opened up this, and then now I'm in the center line for attack. Okay? So if, it, if, it's, if you're a little bit on the outside, you can do the same thing. So on the outside, and then continue forward and now you're on the center line of the attack. So not in, so make sure you, that you are stepping in with 
that motion. So instead of just um, staying one place and he comes and attacks, he comes another one closer and he does another one, move in closer and closer. Now I'm getting stuck and I'm trying to do this, right? You don't want to do that. So what you want to do is overtake that center line as fast as possible. Punch is coming in, boom. I'm already here overtaking the center line on the outside this time, or if it's on the inside, boom. I'm already here on the inside overtaking the center line. Okay, so you basically attack his attack before he can overtake your balance and your center line. Okay, so let me show you a combination that you can use. So let's say he's coming in for a punch, it's like this. He's an attack, let's say hit him, he wants to hit another one. So you got this one, the Hunsa, this one. So that's your combo. The combo would be the one, and then this one. Just like in the dummy form, we went this way, right? So same thing. And then get one come and hit here. So here's how you can use it against very common attack, which is just the left, just the one-two punch, right? So he's doing one-two. So the first way I'm gonna meet, I'm gonna do the same thing. Okay? First one I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna get on the angle on the outside or on the inside. Okay? So if I can get on the outside, for example, this two is coming, then either I can, if I have time, I will hoon it. If I don't have time, then that's what your Wu style is for, your second line of defense, right? Remember we have two. First line of defense, second line of defense. Okay? So he does one, two. One, the two is coming, you have a second line of defense here. Okay? So you can do stuff like that. Boom. Okay? So but make sure you have your first line of defense here. He doesn't want to do it. Go outside. Like you see, he's trying to do the hook. Good thing I have my second line of defense. So I can block here and then go for a uh, rear cross or do the same thing, right? The second line of defense, I can grab here, right? Do the palm and the leg. You want to this there, right? You can do a arm guard, arm break. You can do a wrist lock, whatever you want to do. Stuff like that, okay? So this is very good for um, using it as a defense and using it as an attack. But basically you're occupying that space.